Kenya is earning something like three billion dollars a year from the European market. And they are three times further away from the market, so their freight is prohibitive. We are just five and a half hours, and we are not taking advantage. In fact, as I said, our vegetables were banned from the European market. Honorable Ousu Efriye Akoto is the Ghanaian minister responsible for food and agriculture. And according to him, before the year 2017, Ghana was banned from exporting vegetables to the European Union market because Ghana was not meeting the European Union quality standard of vegetables. As a result of that, the country lost about 30 million US dollars annual revenue. Vegetable exports to the EU market, which is by far the most important market for our vegetables, we were banned. Ghana was banned when we took over because we were not following the regulations by the European community. So the Honorable Minister says Ghana is now improving the quality of the country's vegetables with the new greenhouse farming technology to compete Kenya in the vegetable exportations to the European Union market. Let's hear more from the Ghana Minister responsible for food and agriculture. But before that, please don't forget to like this video. It really helped us grow. Thank you very much for liking. Now, enjoy. Now, the other crop which we talked about, uh, the other module is to do with the greenhouse technology model, which is the uh, vegetable production. If I take you to Kutuka Airport on a Friday night with all those uh, aircraft landing from Europe, you'll be amazed the amount of vegetables that are disgorged from their bowels into Ghana uh, to serve the tourist industry, the hotels and so on. And we think that we can do far better than that in terms of quality and cap capacity. Kenya is earning something like three billion dollars a year from the European market and they are three times further away from the market, so their freight is prohibitive. We are just five and a half hours, and we are not taking advantage. In fact, as I said, our vegetables were banned from the European market when we took over because of lack of discipline and strict adherence to uh, um, the regulations in Europe. So we have come with these three sites in Akumadan, in, uh, in uh, offensive district in Ashanti region in the middle of the country, Bojuasi on the eastern, on the western side of Accra and Dawinya on the eastern side. And we've set up these uh, commercial and trading centers, which uh, is very interesting because we take degree holders, we take certificate holders, diplomats in agriculture, we put them on site seven days a week for three months. Uh, we have this uh, arrangement with the uh, uh, Israeli company for the training. They fly in uh, specialists from Israel to take specific subjects three or four weeks and then they go back. And um, after that, the best amongst them, we take them to Israel to work on kibbutz, which are uh, farms uh, to gain first hand experience. And they come back and it's paid internship. They are not just going there as students, they are not students but it's an internship that they are paid for, for 11 months, and they come back and we help them to settle on these farms. I think that we can show you uh, the, uh, the sites. That's the Darwinia site from the air. You can see that, uh, and Bojuase uh, is the nest. It's, you can see it over there. And then, of course, the last, the latest one, which was commissioned by the president in 2020 in Akomadan. So it's, it's not a, a joke, it's a very serious attempt to be self-sufficient in, 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 in greenhouses, uh, to be uh, in vegetables using greenhouse technology, which is the latest, the most modern method that one can use in vegetables, and also to enter the European market in a very aggressive manner. So this is uh, another seed that the Kufuado government has sown unprecedented. It's never happened in this country before, but in a very serious way, we are doing this and promoting greenhouse technology, and uh, that is beginning to yield a great uh, uh, result for us. You can see me there trying to give pep talk to the students when I visited them in Darwinia two years ago. Thank you very much for watching. Please let us know your thoughts and suggestions inside the comment section below. My name is Sheriff Harana and see you in our next video. Makrao.